All right, time to fire up the 756 and get some stuff done today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Decent day out. Finally uh, got some... Oh, no. Oh, no. I think we got a dead battery. Or do we? So as you can see, I tried to start the tractor and it wouldn't start. My first take on it is dead battery. Why is the battery dead? I don't know. Could be alternator. Could be wiring harness. Could be terminal connectors. Could be a lot of things. Say you're out in the field and you don't have a meter on you. How do you find out? How do you exclude the alternator? Well, I'm going to show you here real quick. Stay tuned. All right, so you're out in the field. You're dead in the water. You call your buddy. He comes and jumps you because you don't have a jump pack. How do you tell if it's the alternator or battery? You pull the negative terminal, or cable, I should say. If the tractor continues to run, it's your battery. If it dies, it's your alternator. Now, here's the thing. There's other things you got to look at, just as I was saying, the wiring and whatnot. But I've lived a long time, and this, is, this hack has always worked for me. So I'm going to pull the negative terminal off, and we're going to see if the tractor continues to run. Guess what? I got a bad alternator. It's not charging the battery. Now here's the thing. Maybe it's not a bad alternator, but I definitely need to check the wiring and that's where I'm going to start. So just a little hack for you. Um, I'm not going to film doing the wiring because it's mundane. Have a great day. Thanks for watching.